Hello guys, Soft Tony here and welcome back to the short tutorial series. In today's video we will be creating a modern transition that you can easily use to make your slideshow or intro. So click that like and subscribe button and without any further ado, let's start creating. Alright, we're here in After Effects and as you can see I already have this final composition and our next step is gonna be to create solid layer, go right click and find here solid, this is gonna be a fan for fractal noise, hit OK. Now go here in the facts and preset and find fractal noise effect, drag and drop on this solid, OK. And here let's change fractal type from basic to turbulent smooth. And for the noise type, instead of this soft linear, change to block. Also here for the complexity, let's lower down to 1. Now open up this transform option. And for the scaling, let's go 210, OK. Also for the offset turbulence, let's go 1045. And for the Y parameter, 515. Now let's go here to the zero frames and let's also change the contrast from 100 to 500 and for the brightness let's go to around minus 500 okay and set up the first keyframe now go to around two seconds and let's type 100 okay now hit this fractal noise layer hit you to show all of the keyframes grab them hit f9 for easy ease and go to graph editor and draw a curve like this okay now select this solid layer go right click pre-compose and this is gonna be just F and composition, OK, make sure to select the second option, hit OK. Now let's find here track mats and if you can find them just hit here toggle switches and modes and let's find luma mat for this media 01. And now we have animation like this and now let's duplicate this fractal noise composition, hit Ctrl plus D, go here in the facts and preset and let's find find edges effect, drag and drop on this first fractal noise, check the visibility on, also check this invert option. And now let's duplicate this layer once again, hit Ctrl plus D. And now let's also go Luma Matte for this fractal noise. And now when we hit zero here in the final composition, we have this great looking animation in our final composition. What we can do for the end, hit S for scaling for this media 01. I have already scaled this down. Let's go to around 40. And now let's go to around four seconds and let's type here 33. Of course here you will probably see different values but you can type here from 100 maybe 110 to around 100 just play around until you're satisfied with your own final results hit zero and this is looking awesome all right guys that was everything for today's tutorial subscribe and share also hit the like button and until next time stay creative and bye bye